Hey guys, and welcome to another video. This time, I'm going to be discussing a different boxing match. There's another boxing match on this evening. It is coming live from America in the Stub Hub Center, California. Gennady Golovkin versus Vanes Matravosian. Gennady Golovkin's record, 37-1 and draw with no defeats and 33 KOs. Vanes Matravosian, 36 wins. Three losses, one draw, 21 KOs. This fight has come on the back of um, of a fight that Golovkin was going to go into against Saul Canelo Alvarez. Now, in his last fight against Saul Canelo Alvarez, he drew. And then, and then Saul Canelo Alvarez had a drugs test. And they found clubeterol in his system from contaminated meat, which I think is rubbish. You know, you know... If you're getting contaminated meat or not. And surely. Your nutritionist will know if it's contaminated meat. And will cook you the right foods. You know. You won't take it to a restaurant. Unless you're having a proper meal. You know. Unless it's your treat day. And to be honest. I just think it's rubbish. I just don't think that's, that's even possible. To get contaminated meat in your system. When you've got a fight coming up. When you should be on nutritional foods. Now, Golovkin is a great fighter, absolute animal, machine, you know. Um, his last five fights, so obviously we had Canelo Alvarez a draw. Danny Jacobs, he won on points, which I think was a good, good, good fight. You know, Danny Jacobs gave him a good match, you know, it was a bit, you know, hit and miss from Golovkin at, at first. I thought, you know, it wasn't the Golovkin we used to see him. The Kelbrook win, Golovkin was ill, supposedly. Um, the night of the fight, but he still won on t in the fifth round over the TKO win. You know, I thought Brooke gave heart in that fight, and it was it was a good fight. I really enjoyed that fight. Dominic Wade, you know, basic fighter, basic mandatory fighter for his IBF title. You know, simple win. And David Lemieux, you know, we all thought he was something special as well. We all thought, you know, he had some power. You know, he was going to do some great stuff. He was an IBF world champion. But... He didn't really show up against Golovkin. You know, Golovkin took his power, most powerful shots, and you know, Billy Joe Saunders beat Lemieux in his last in his last fight as well. You know, that's a fight that down the line I'd like to see is Gennady Golovkin versus Billy Joe Saunders. I think Golovkin will absolutely muller him. I don't think there's a chance that Billy Joe Saunders can do anything in that fight. It's going to be an interesting one though. Okay, so let's talk about Golovkin's new opponent. Vanes Motrasian. Uh, he's a good fighter. He's been in world title fights. He's not the best fighter in the world, mind. Um, his last fight, his last five fights, his last fight he lost against Erislan de Lara, a great fighter, a great technical technician, you know, Cuban. He lost on a unanimous, unanimous decision. You know, his, uh, his, his, his third fight, his second fight then, Isha Smith, he won. I don't know much about this guy. You know, he obviously sounds quite a big man, to be honest. He won on a majority... He beat Isha Smith on majority decision. Jamel Charlo, good champion. Good, you know, great fight. Great fighter, the 154 um, division. You know, I see him as a great fighter. You know, he beat um, Metro Rossian by, you know, decision. Willie Nelson, don't know much about him. Sounds like... A bit like a bit man, you know. He, Metroisian beat him on the last decision. Mario Alberto Lozan, Lozano won again. He beat Lonza, Lozano on a unanimous decision. You know, we don't know much about that guy either. This fight, you know, it could be a bit hit and miss for Golovkin. It could just be, you know, two rounds over. But I would like to see Golovkin, you know, give this guy a good chance, you know, to see what it, see how he reacts to his first, to Golovkin's first shots. We all know Golovkin's a machine. We all know we could out him in the first round. We all know that Golovkin is one of the pound for pound top fighters in the world, and we saw that against um, the likes of uh, Canelo Alvarez, you know, uh, Danny Jacobs, Kel Brook, you know, he not. He knocked the holy living hell out of all three of them. And Canelo Alvarez had drugs in his system, supposedly, at the time. Um, 
you know, I'd like to see that Gol that Golovkin Canelo fight again, but as long as Canelo is clean, I'd, and there are rumors that are going around that on September fifteenth we will see that fight. I think that we're going to see a different Golovkin tonight. I see. I think we're going to going to see a Golovkin that will be the old Golovkin. You know, something that we haven't seen in a while. Um, taking out people, you know, um, and really making it, putting on a drama show. Big drama show, as he says. Um, you know, I like his style. Mexican style fighter, you know, everyone enjoys that sort of style. Um, <clears throat> likes being close. What I think is, though, Mitch, Mitch Rossian is going to give it a go tonight. He's going to give it a go. He's going to give it all. You know, this is his one chance of supremacy. You know, I reckon after this fight, he'll probably just go back to fighting big men. You know, as normal. Um, he's not really built for world title scene. You know, he's pr we proved that against uh, Eris Lande Lara. Against someone... He could probably win a world title against someone lower than Eris Lande Lara, lower than Golovkin, you know. But... I don't see this guy even beating Golovkin. It's um, it's not something I see happening. Um, and if it did, it'd be a shock to the world. Let me tell you that now. It'd be a shock to my because I might have a heart attack. Um... But yeah, I'm really looking forward to this fight. Um, I just want to see Golovkin go out to all his old. He's one of my favourite fighters, you know. But, you know, we'll see what happens. Uh, I don't know much about the undercard. I know there's a big world title fight in the women's boxing on the undercards for a unification fight, I think. I don't know the names of these people. Um, but, you know, I'm, I just want to see Golovkin take this guy out and just move on. Fight Danny Jacobs again. Knock Danny Jacobs out, hopefully. But, you know, we'll see. But, you know, hope you enjoyed this video. You know, I'm not, it's not the best video. But give me a thumbs up. Comment what you think, what your thoughts are. Subscribe. And peace out. Keep smiling.